Welcome to the Great Hall. So many enchanting opportunities and mysterious clues await you. Look around the many halls and explore the grounds. But don't forget your goal, to find the secret hidden within. Remember, however, the third floor corridor on the right-hand side is out of bounds to anyone who does not wish to die a most painful death. Welcome to the entrance to Diagon Alley, where one can purchase school supplies for the coming term. Do you recall how to enter? See if you can remember the right combination of bricks. Think hard. Select the bricks in clockwise order. I shouldn't have said that. And press enter to enter. Welcome, Harry, to Diagon Alley. Gringotts, the Wizard Bank. Take no safer place, not one, except perhaps Hogwarts. Maybe the tightest security in this or any world, run by goblins and guarded by dragons. Step up to the window to make a withdrawal if you have your key. You've got your key. Behold your closely guarded fortune of gold galleons, silver sickles, and bronze nuts. Now, off with you. Your school supplies await. And remember, you'll need another key. A silver one with a broken wing for your journey to the stone. Welcome to Ollivanders, makers of fine wands since 382 BC. Every Hogwarts student needs a wand for Professor Flitwick's class. You'll need one too. Unlike many purchases here at Ollivanders, the wizard does not choose the wand, the wand chooses the wizard. And no two wands are alike. Let's see if we can't find a match, shall we? Ten and a quarter inches long, swishy, made of willow, very good for charm work. Wonderful wand, but not a match. Try this springy ebony and unicorn hair, eight and a half inch. Wonderful wand, but not a match. Oh, beech wood and dragon heart string, nine inches, very flexible. Very good. That will be seven gold galleons, please. Welcome to Ilop's Owl Emporium. Obviously, you are in need of an owl. How else will you be able to communicate across the distances? Muggle mail? Just click on each owl to hear about it. Oh, the tawny. A fine, fine owl. This owl can catch bats in flight. Ah, the barn owl. You'll just love its long, rasping screech. The snowy owl. A remarkable creature. Here's a little tip. It's always nice to slip your owl bits of toast accompanied by a pat on the head. I have a few start-of-term notices I wish to announce. 
Considered by many the greatest wizard of modern times, Dumbledore is particularly famous for his defeat of the dark wizard Grindelwald in 1945, for the discovery of the 12 uses of dragon's blood, and his work on alchemy with his partner, Nicholas Flamel. Only a person who wanted to find the stone, but not use it, would be able to get it. That is one of my more brilliant ideas. Professor Dumbledore enjoys chamber music and ten-pin bowling. Ah, Bertie Botts, every flavor beans. A lot. Earwax. Cast a spell over Hogwarts and hear everyone speak in the language you choose. The stone shall be found. Look at your choices, and the right one shall be shaped like a full moon. So you've decided to visit the third floor corridor. Don't say you weren't warned. For your first trial on your journey to the stone, answer the following puzzle. Answer wrong, and you'll be gone. What will you use to get past Fluffy? The invisibility cloak? Wand? Turkey? Or flute? Congratulations, Fluffy's slobber missed you, and you're one step closer to the stone. You know what to do. Look for a key. The color of a sickle and the sky above. The key may be imperfect, but it will fit perfectly. Seven bottles. Some are poison. One is wine, and one will send you back. Ah, but one will help you reach the stone. You have 60 seconds to decide. Choose wisely. I see you've found the deepest, most desperate desire of your heart, the stone. Take it now and enjoy your reward. It's time to see what you have learned. Select the proper ingredients to make each of the three potions to follow, then mix to see if you're correct. But do be careful, very, very careful. Create the sleeping potion known as the Draft of Living Death by mixing two of these ingredients.
which two ingredients are also known as aconite. When you want to cure a boil, which two will you mix? You know what to do. Look for a key. The color of a sickle and the sky above. The key may be imperfect, but it will fit perfectly.